Okay, we're about 195 hours into our sailing trip from Bermuda to Portugal. Um, prior to that, we did seven days coming from the British Virgin Islands up to Bermuda. And then we had uh, a few days in Bermuda to reorganize. And then we set out, uh, as you know, from uh, Bermuda and are making our way to Azores, Portugal. We're about just shy of 600 miles uh, to go to make our way to the Azores. And uh, we just weathered a big storm for a couple days. And last night, uh, the wind shifted on us, came around to the northwest. So we had to change our sails in the middle of the night. So we went from the sails, uh, the wind hitting us from the starboard side across where the sails are on the port side to the uh, sails going to the starboard side and the wind coming across the port end of the boat. And um, now we're in, on, on course. You can see the sunrise. Let's see if we can get it here for you. Like a sunrise coming up. <clears throat> right now we're heading on course again. And that's what it's all about. It's gonna put the sails in position to keep you on course. And um, the winds have dropped down. The sea has really calmed down. You can see it's quite calm now. Um, although always kind of rolling around and waves coming through. Nothing like the uh, 15 to 20 foot swell that we had yesterday, really big. And when you're on the bow of the boat and you're changing the sails, the number one rule is to not go overboard, right? So you gotta be really careful, especially with the big swells. You get a little bit more uh, sea legs under you after a while, so you're a little more stable on the bobbing boat. But um, nonetheless, it's really important to move uh, slow and methodically. And as a team, uh, there's a guy at the helm that's steering the boat. There's a guy that's working the winch on the port side in the back, say if we're coming across uh, and moving our boom and everybody stays safe. So it was a busy day, uh, busy 24 hours in the storm. And now things are uh, just, you know, slowly uh, the winds are um, decreasing. Although what we're looking at in the forecast is another um, low front that we'll be passing through. So I think we'll have about 12 hours of this lighter wind condition. We are cruising right now at 7.8 knots. So we're making fairly good time. We've got a force three wind, which is pretty light, uh, but steady. And our main sail and our stay sail is out. Our Yankee sail is put away at the moment. Uh, it's not the best wind direction for it. We're on a, you know, kind of a closed hall here. So um, we're just having the sun come up and uh, it's about six o'clock in the morning and still on watch for a couple more hours on this shift. We're hoping that we'll be arriving in the Azores in about four days. So that would be uh, sometime Monday for us. You know, we're just kind of enjoying another beautiful day out here in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean behind me again <laughs> which is pretty much sky and sea and um, horizon line uh, and the waves so um, it's, it's been really good and uh, just kind of hoping that uh, this next low front treats us well and I know that the winds are supposed to come back up to around the 40 mile an hour 40 knot range and the swell usually accompanies that as well and uh, we'll get through that and that'll probably push us right into the Azores and we'll make our way in there. So um, it's been a fun, uh, exciting and adventure so far and looking forward to uh, finishing it off strong here in the next few days.